Hello. I still remember how much fun I had when I first got Painter. It was like being handed the biggest box of art tools I could imagine and had great fun working my way through all of them, painting test strokes and discovering early favourites. New users of Painter can feel a little bit overwhelmed though by the sheer number of brush categories and brush variants within them. Added to that is the fact that all of the brushes can be tweaked, altered and customised using Painter's brush controls. The brush control panels themselves can be a bit intimidating to people unfamiliar with them. The new advanced brush controls panel makes things a little easier by narrowing down the controls for each brush to only the most important to that particular brush variant. But one of the first things that impressed me greatly about Painter was how most of the brushes work so well out of the box without tweaking anything. I do much of my drawing and painting using only a very small selection of painters default brushes. I like to try others out from time to time and modify brushes but I keep coming back to these simple yet effective favourite brush variants. Brushes like painters real 2B pencil are so easy to use because most of us are familiar with their real world counterparts and we're familiar with the range of marks that they can make. If I hold my pen straight up and down, I get a very sharp, small point. If I angle my pen more, I get the effect of using the side of a pencil. My art teachers hated people shading with the side of their pencils, almost as much as they hated people using black paint. But the subtle variations in the marks made just by using the pen normally make drawing seem more natural. The way the pencils interact with painter's paper textures is a second important factor in making a digital drawing look much like its real world counterpart. Painter comes with many papers but I often forget to switch or change them and 90% of my stuff is drawn on painter's basic paper which luckily for me also works well out of the box. At the moment I'm working on a prop book for a short film the small collection of brush variants that I have in this small custom palette were used for all of the illustration parts of the book. I used the real 2B pencil, the Just Add Water blender, the real pointy blender and the scratchboard tool. I'll leave you with a bit of speeded up video of me creating one of the characters for the book. I hope this video has shown you that you don't have to delve straight into painter's customisation of brushes and it's possible to use brushes straight out of the box that work really really well.